Hey everyone, this is Scott with Travify, and in this video, we're going to do a really quick about 10 minute overview of Travify's uh, platform and all the tools that are built in. So it's going to go by really fast. Uh, but then if you're interested in taking a closer look, doing a one on one uh, demo and going through at a more relaxed pace, uh, feel free to reach out to myself or Doug from my team. And we're happy to connect with you and schedule something so that we can uh, do a more one on one demo with you that way. Now, Travify also offers a really fantastic uh, customer support service. Uh, we have a fantastic team. Team, uh, to help you. We offer live chat, uh, email based support, uh, dedicated webinars, one on one zoom training sessions, as well as on demand uh, video tutorials and webinars that you can watch to help you get started. Now, uh, uh, additionally, what I also like to point out is all of the new functionality that Travify offers. We offer itinerary management with destination content, supplier integrations and mobile apps as well as quoting and proposal tools, a simple CRM system uh, at, where you can manage client information. And then that's fully integrated in with Travify's custom forms. So you can create client information forms or credit card authorization forms to send to clients and securely collect information that way. Uh, but then we have also added in a website builder. You can build and host your website in Travify or use it as a marketing landing page. So all of that functionality is included in your subscription uh, on Travify. There's no additional cost to any one of those pieces. Uh, so it's really a fantastic value that way. Uh, so you can start a free trial at Travify.com. The standard free trial is 10 days, but we can always extend that out longer if you need. Just reach out to our support team and we're happy to do that for you. But uh, definitely start a free trial and schedule a demo with us. Now with that, let's actually jump into the software and take a look. So uh, I'm in my account. Once you start your free trial, one of the first things you can do is fill out your profile to add in your photo and logo and uh, contact details because all of that gets placed on the top of the itineraries and quotes that you create with Travify. Uh, with Travify, you can create itineraries or proposals. The big difference between the two, as you see with the sample proposal, is that it gives the client an option, obviously, to review that proposal uh, within here. Uh, they can view all of the great content and information that's included in within here. You can add in photos and videos, import content from suppliers, really simple process. But the big difference is that approval option. Clients can actually click to approve the proposal uh, online. And when they do that, uh, Travify will notify you and send a PDF copy to you into the client so that everyone has clear records of that approval taking place. Now let's jump into uh, looking at how you can use the trip builder to start with. We'll cover the trip builder as well as the uh, simple CRM forms and website builder, but let's start with the trip builder uh, where you build itineraries and proposals. So I will go into the Smith family Los Cabos getaway within here. Now Travify also offers many different CRM integrations. So reach out to our customer support team if you use a specific CRM uh, to find out if we have an integration with it. We have many integrations with a lot of the popular CRMs in the travel advisor industry. Uh, available that you can use. Now, to start with in the uh, in the itinerary and proposal builder interface, uh, to start with, I can choose the settings option. That's where I can update basic information like the trip name, start date, or pricing. Really straightforward that way. You can also add in a beautiful cover photo with Travify's stock photo library. Uh, as you can see here, where you can search destination terms or subject matter terms and just click on a photo to add that in. But now, in terms of adding information, adding bookings or content to the uh, to the proposal within here, your starting point will either be that blue button that says new event, and you can choose different categories uh, to choose from, and Travify has different databases and integrations behind each of these that I'll just briefly touch on during the video. As well, you have your library on the right side. Now, these are items you frequently use. You can just save them to your library. So maybe it's a hotel you're booking all of the time, or a tour, or a list of recommendations cancellation policies, you can save those to your library and then just drag and drop them onto a proposal to add them in anytime you need to. Now, uh, to start with, just to walk through some of these options, I'll choose new event. And in here, uh, to go through the list under activity and lodging, Travify does have a worldwide places database where you can search millions of hotels and uh, restaurants and business businesses and landmarks worldwide. You can just search by name and add one in from our general properties database. Again, it's like a Google places search. 
uh, so you can search an ad really easily. If you're a Virtuoso advisor, Travify is Virtuoso preferred. Uh, so we do have the Virtuoso property database built into the platform where you can just uh, search by name like you see here and pull up any of the Virtuoso properties and then import that property with the Virtuoso photos, description, and Virtuoso amenities automatically included in for you. Uh, now that imports in in a really nice format uh, where, you, for example, you can see basic content that imports in uh, on the right side there. You can edit or make changes or remove any of this information if you prefer. But then as well, if you click on the uh, event here, you can also uh, import in lots of great content. I'll show you a quick trick in here. In addition to the stock photo library, you can upload photos of your own or import uh, photos from a supplier website link. So you can uh, uh, just paste in the link to a hotel or tour operator website and then go through and import photos from the website just by clicking on those to select those and add those to the gallery. We also have a video import or video embedding process. Just paste in the link of a YouTube or Vimeo video to include that in. Uh, now, additionally, you can uh, also attach in documents or vouchers if needed with the attach documents option. So pretty simple process uh, to do that way. Now, uh, within the new event button, you'll also see a flight option. Travify does have a live flights database. There are a few different ways to add in flights. Uh, one of the simplest is just adding in an airline and a flight number. And you can uh, go ahead and import that in. I think I keyed that in wrong, but you'll see what that flight information looks like within here where it will import the flight details. You can always custom or edit these details or attach in e-tickets by double clicking on the flight event. Travify will also register the flight for automatic updates. That way any schedule changes or gate changes will be automatically updating for you and for your clients. Uh, so a very simple and easy process that way to bring in the flight information and have them automatically update. Now, you can also add in ground transportation manually, or sometimes what I suggest is to create templates of common types of ground transfers that you use all of the time. So you can see some templates in my library. I've created those. It's really easy to create them. You just drag and drop them over onto a proposal or to an itinerary to add them in, and then you can double click on it to fill in the blanks or make changes to them. And that can really help speed up the process of building proposals and itineraries. Now, uh, if I choose new event, you'll also see options for cruise, uh, tour, and booking in that list. Travify offers over 100 different supplier integrations you can access. Uh, we have 40 of the major cruise lines worldwide already integrated in within the platform, so you can import full day-by-day -day cruise itineraries. Additionally, uh, we also have a database of packaged and escorted tours. So these are multi-day scheduled tours uh, from various tour operators, about 40 different suppliers you can import from. But then as well, under the booking option, these are custom bookings we've built directly with tour operators and suppliers that you can uh, choose from. Now we're always adding in new suppliers. So if you don't see a supplier you like to use in this list currently today, reach out to our support team because we're always adding in new integrations. Uh, but you can uh, choose a supplier, uh, sign in with your email and password and then import a custom booking from the supplier that way. Uh, now, lastly, within the itinerary builder, uh, we do have a database of destination content and city guides. That's over on the right side where you can search by name, uh, as you can see here, select one and then import a uh, specific content. You can choose from sections like the city, points of interest, etc. Uh, you also have all of the points of interest that you can use independently and you can just drag and drop this content in. You can see some of it that I've already added into this uh, itinerary or to this proposal uh, where then a client can uh, double click click or you can double click on it rather to edit or customize any of the content so it's a really simple process that way. Now when you're ready to send a proposal off to a client at the top you'll see options for PDF, preview, and send. So you can export a print friendly version with the PDF option. You have a client preview or you can choose send. We always recommend the send option and email invite. You can just uh, add in your client's email address or paste in multiple email addresses to send it to them that way. They can just tap a button in the email to view the proposal or the itinerary and I'll load the client preview here. This is the uh, proposal that uh, uh, we built in Travify uh, just with a few basic components so that you can see what that looks like. It uh, has uh, you know the travel advisor's photo, logo, and contact details at the top. The client can scroll through. Again, it's mobile friendly so it looks great on a smartphone or tablet. The client can click through to view any of the content as well within there and just a really professional uh, presentation and experience that way. Now the client can tap on the app option to download a free mobile app 
called the Trip Plans app. Uh, this is the client-facing mobile app. There's also a mobile app for you as the travel advisor or uh, or a, a travel professional called the Travify Pro app. Uh, so that's the app that you want to download. You can access any of your quotes and itineraries. But for the client, they'll download the Trip Plans app. In there, uh, when they load the itinerary, they'll see your logo, photo, and contact details. They can tap on specific days to view live flight information or ground transportation details. Uh, hotel information, etc. So it's really simple and professional way to present it. It does have offline mode as well as client chat built in uh, to really personalize that experience with clients that way. So that's a quick overview of the itinerary and proposal builder interface. A lot of additional functionality and tools you can access. Just schedule a demo with us. But uh, next, I want to cover the simple CRM and form. So you'll find that under the contact section. Uh, in the simple CRM, this is designed to be a really simple streamlined way to uh, manage client information. Uh, you can create individual contacts or import a spreadsheet of contacts within here. Uh, on clients or co client profiles within here, you can uh, manage uh, high level notes and descriptions. You can add in uh, contact information or create custom fields to manage. You can also store and organize notes uh, within here on uh, specific clients. The system will automatically track past quotes or itineraries you've sent off to the client, and then it's fully integrated with Travify's custom forms. So in your library, you can create your own custom forms and choose different question types and uh, formatting for questions, as well as you can create credit card authorizations and select that op option um, to securely collect client payment details. Um, you can also choose smart fields, so you can map information from a form into a field on uh, Travify's uh, CRM, and then you can send a form. You can share a link to a form with a group or on an individual client or contact. You can choose to send the form uh, to the client, and when they fill out the information, it all populates back to Travify in that form section, uh, and you can just click to view the responses that the client has submitted in that form. So it can really help streamline that, streamline that process, collecting information from your clients and organizing and managing that. Uh, directly in Travify. Uh, so that's all within the simple CRM and forms, and we have lots of new enhancements coming out uh, over the coming months for that. Now lastly, the website builder, you can click on your name at the top and choose website. Uh, really easy to uh, access that and, uh, and pull that up. And within here, you can choose from different design templates and themes. Uh, really simple to do. You can choose the theme option and then switch and toggle between those themes and choose the one that you like. You can customize the branding and colors. You can also choose different layout elements in here. So we give you a lot of different professional looking elements uh, that you can choose from. But then as you uh, choose these and start building them out, you just click on a section to edit or update any of the text. You can switch out photos. You can even import trips from your Travify account. If you want to feature certain packages uh, or promotions and products, uh, you can import those in that way. So really fun and easy to update. Uh, but then once you're, you've are you set up that, uh, that website that you want to uh, get started with, just click Publish and you can uh, launch your website that way using your own custom domain uh, and incorporate domain masking into your website or landing page as well as into your itinerary and proposal links. Uh, so a lot of really great value you can get out of Travify that way. Now we do have a great support center with the help option in the top right corner. You can access our getting started guide, tutorial videos, training sessions, and webinars. So we give you a lot of different ways to get help as you get started with Travify. But uh, lastly, thanks for taking the time. Uh, feel free to start a free trial at Travify.com and then uh, go ahead and schedule a demo with myself or Doug and we're happy to connect with you and answer any questions that you have. But thanks again and have a great day.